Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between the Vikaltal and Tigran Petrosian. This is the game from Soviet Union, Team Cup Championship, played in 1974. Mikhail Tal held by the pieces and he started with the knight to f3. Petrosian played g6, e4, bishop to g7, d4, d6, knight to c3, knight to f6, bishop to e2, and both players castled kingside. Petrosian is playing Pitt's defense. Knight to c6, d5 attacking the knight. And black has a choice. Knight to b8 or knight to e5. Petrosian played knight to b8. If knight to e5, then knight takes knight, pawn takes knight, and black would end up with double pawns. Petrosian wanted to have a neat pawn structure and played knight to b8. Rook to e1 placing the rook on the file that will open. e5, d takes on e6, bishop takes on e6, bishop to f4, h6, knight to d4 attacking the bishop, bishop to d7, queen to d2 threatening bishop takes on h6, king to h7, e5, d takes on e5, bishop takes on e5, black to move. Surely Petrosian considered knight to c6. Instead he wanted to win the bishop. White the r squared bishop and played knight to e4. If knight to c6, one line goes like this. Knight takes knight. Bishop takes knight. Queens are exchanged and then white wins a pawn on c7. Okay, in the game we have knight to e4, knight takes knight, bishop takes on e5, knight to f3, attacking the bishop, bishop to g7. If bishop takes on b2, Tal would play rook from a to d1. We have bishop to g7, rook from a to d1. Black to move. Black would love to play knight to c6, it doesn't work because of queen takes on d7. We have a queen to c8, bishop to c4. Pressure is on the pawn on f7. Bishop to e8, more protection to the pawn. This is a very interesting position. Have a good look at this position. White pieces are better placed. Most of the black pieces are on the back rank. But how to continue white to move? Please pause the video and try to guess the move that Tal played. What did you find? Tal sacrificed the knight for the attack. This is check. Pawn takes knight. Knight takes on g5 check, king to g8. Now Tal wants to bring his queen to h7 to checkmate black king. So this is the first step, queen to f4, intending queen to h4 and then queen to h7 checkmate. Knight to d7, intending knight to f6. White to move, how would you continue? I will ask you to pause the video again and to find the best move for white. Hmm? What is the move? The knight would be defender of h7, so Tal sacrificed the exchange. Bishop takes on d7. White play the move and black resigned. The move is bishop takes on f7. Petrosian resigned. Queen to h4 is also winning. 
of the say rook to e8 bishop takes on f7 but we have bishop takes on f7 and Petrosian resigned in view of this continuation rook takes bishop then a queen takes rook check king to h8 queen takes on g6 intending queen to h7 checkmate bishop to f5 preventing checkmate knight to f7 check king to g8 knight to h6 check forking the king and the bishop king to h8 knight takes bishop threatening queen takes bishop defending the bishop queen to h5 check king to g8 knight to e7 check and what now queen takes knight then rook takes queen with the checkmate to follow soon and let's go back to move 19 this is the position did you guess the move in this position knight sacrifice and what about this position did you spot exchange sacrifice if you found both of these moves congratulations and that is all i hope that you enjoyed watching this video i wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now